here at Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas, Nevada. Audrey? Yes. The question is, what's new this year for Circuit Cubes? We were at the show last year showing some of the beginning cubes, the battery, motor, and light. Um, this year we're bringing in a bunch of output devices, so a uh, motion switch, or motion output, it's very tired at the end of the show, Yeah. and a bunch of switches, knife switch, uh, potentiometer, and an NONC switch. The other exciting thing we've got is a Bluetooth-enabled battery cube. So I'm going to see if I can do some little battle here. Hey, now. I'm turning my weapon on because I've got a three That's out. That's not fair. Right. Aha! Uh -huh. Weapon is, is <laughs> the same. So when you say Bluetooth cube, you mean you're just this is connected as a controller yeah, to your so device. Yeah, so we have some secret sauce. So the, the regular power cube is going to be like basically stepped up a notch. So basically the the hidden inside here is going to be not only the battery capability um, and the traditional uh, outputs, but now it has three connectors on it for three outputs, A, B, C. And if you are a total geek like me, you know that this is a standard 2.54 pitch millimeter, so it will plug into, guess what, Arduino. So now you can plug this into your Arduino, build your robot out of Legos, and then plug this into our motors. Ta-da! Hey, now! <laughs> um, so the main thing is we want to make sure that we know we're always out of box, hands on, get your hands dirty and make build stuff. But we know that there's also times when you just want to get playful with it. And beyond that, when we talk about the next phases of that, we'll make sure we're going to include the concepts where they can learn from it because some people like to look a book, look through a book pages. Some people want to watch a video to see how to build the device. Maybe they're having trouble figuring out gear ratios or some complex thing that you know they don't know about or maybe their parent wants to help guide them to the concept. When does the Bluetooth Cube come out? So we're, both things are coming out of what we would call late late spring, early summer. So there's going to be a Bluetooth kit based around the three things you just saw kicking around this table. So this one, this one, and I call this dude Atmosphere because he's very tall. Did you know there's five layers in the atmosphere? I, uh, yeah. <laughs> of course, I, I, of course I, did, I knew that. I did know Doesn't that. anyone know that? So you'll be able to build any one of these independent vehicles with all the parts and pieces. Oh, sorry. That little thing wasn't included, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> That's a bonus feature just for you. Um, and then the cool thing is we will also sell the Bluetooth a la carte. The pricing is not announced yet, but they will be included in all the a la carte cubes. So this will be another kit that will be available. So check it out. We got tilt switch, a little ball goes back and forth so you can have a tilt sensor. You have a high speed motor for some more action. You have a potentiometer, which is also like your variable resistor or the uh, dimmer knob on your room. The uh, offset weighted motor, which vibrates. Your RGB, so you can mix and match eight colors from the RGB, red, green, and blue. Your traditional super duper torque motor, which you're seeing run most of these vehicles. The NONC, which is in Super Geek Talk, is normally open or normally closed to do things like she'll grab me a little trick over there. The uh, uh, the mechanical buzzer, which vibrates. Ah. So that's it. That's I put those in the cookie jars when the kid opens it, and these will also be available a la carte. So if you want to bling out your ruler ring or your ruler rings, or maybe you already have the bright lights, wacky wheels, or smart art, and you want to enhance that capability. Keep us posted. Well, thank you so much for your time and uh, rock on. You bet. We'll be around. Thank you, Audrey. Thank you.